Misapplication, diversion, fraud and outright pilfering of government funds has become endemic in the country. Year in, year out, the Auditor General's report tabulates gross misuse of resources in trillions of kwacha. The anti-graft watchdog Transparent International Zambia, TIZ, is concerned. Government is treating the problem with kids' gloves. We are quite uh, shocked and disturbed that... Um government officials entrusted with huge amounts of money can have such withdrawals without a clear explanation. TIZ Executive Director Goodwill Lungu is disturbed with his organization's finding on the Constituents Development Fund CDF abuse at the Minister of Local Government. The 1.3 million that was meant for Rufonsa was dubiously transferred without Treasury Authority from um, the CDF account to a grants account held by the ministry. And these checks were issued to three very junior officials. His call is for President Michael Sata to act on the controlling officer at the Ministry of Local Government. We therefore call on the Republican president to take a clear action on the controlling officers who presided over the many regularities that we have cited. Over and above, he has given the law enforcement agencies 48 hours to bring the culprits to book and recover the looted resources. Resources adequate enough to put up a rural health center in Rufunza constituency where the money was diverted from. We therefore call upon the law enforcement agencies to within the next 48 hours to start probing where these funds ended up and if these funds were, reco we were stolen, we recommend immediate seizure of all potential suspects' accounts and restriction orders to be placed on their properties. Recently, Secretary to the Treasury acknowledged that funds released to the Minister of Local Government were being mismanaged and proposed measures to keep the rot. Oswald Yaman II, Movie TV News, Rusaka.